you've seen the comments. I've seen the comments. We've all seen the comments. I need to tell on you to your parents, okay? Because some of you are wild and out in my comment section. But today I thought I'd, I'd channel that feral energy in my comment section and say, you know what? Some of you are right, and that's unsettling to me. And today, we're going to settle it and rank every single one of my doppelgangers to see exactly how much they look like me. So as you can see right here, we've got this beautiful tier list, okay? I was trying to think of uh, how to name the tiers, and I just got stuck. So I said, you know what? We're going classic S, A, B, C, D, and F. The unfortunate thing is I don't think a lot of these are going to live in the F tier because unfortunately a lot of these things really do look like me. So I've gathered a couple options today based on, again, my comment section because you guys love to spam exactly who I look like in my comments, especially new people that haven't seen my videos. They just love to sit there and type on their keyboard and go, <laughs> you look like Mr. Clean. You look like uh, that guy from that anime. So the first one we're starting off with is, you know, the stonks meme that dude this guy he looks scarily accurate to what i look like if like what is his face he's like just a soft smile so if i do you got scared there for a sec I, you didn't know who was who this one is unfortunately setting a bar that i don't think any of the others can meet the expectations of i think i found my twin this guy's definitely going in the S tier. Like I said, he's setting a bar that no one is going to match. We're doing that right off the bat. To tell all of these other bald freak weirdos, you got nothing on him, okay? So we can throw him up in the S tier right there. He can he can live nicely up there. Maybe we'll put a little, little crown on his head, make him feel like a pretty little princess. <laughs> All right, next up to bat, we got Agent 47. It's just a classic. You ever play the game Hitman? This is literally what I look like when I wear a suit for any kind of business thing. But again, this man has eyebrows. And I'm saying, come on, baby, we need smooth. If you got any hair, I don't care. The other thing is that this guy's like chiseled and ripped. And I am the complete opposite of that. I'm smooth. I'm soft featured, a little bit slopey here and there. I turn to the side. It's honestly a right angle at this point. But, you know, I could put on a suit and I could look just like him, okay? Wait, wait a second. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to put that suit on, okay? And we'll, we'll exactly see how close that is, okay? That was a pretty close resemblance, but I think, I think he's a little hotter than me, unfortunately. I feel like, God, I don't know. I would put him in A, but I feel like there's going to be someone a little bit better. Like, I could cosplay as Hitman, okay? I would put on a suit with a red tie and people would be like, Hitman? And I'd be like, yes, but shh, because I'm going to murder you. So I think he's going in A for now. He might he might change. He might switch up. I think I'm just going to do A for now, okay? The sad thing looking at a lot of these is I think we're going to be staying in the SAB tier. And I don't know how much I like that. <laughs> All right, next up we have Billy Corgan. I see this so many times in my comments and I'm just like, ha ha ha, yeah, totally. But then I look up a picture of him and I'm like, yeah, totally. You know, again, he's got to get docked points, okay? Because he has hair and he's had hair. So I don't know, Billy, do you look like me? Okay, so I think an S tier is exactly me. Okay, that looks just like me. It doesn't matter. A tier is if I dress up as you, you get it instantly. You know, then B tier is like someone who's like in the relative vicinity of what I look like. And I, I think Billy Corgan's a B. B for Billy. Okay, we're going to give it to you. All right, up next, we got our favorite bad boy and absolute little bitch, Caillou. I get this in a lot of my comments that I look like Caillou. And honestly, I'm a big perpetrator of this issue. The whole problem in general, people bully me in my comments is doing the part because I, I tell people to, okay? So don't feel too bad for me. Look how happy this kid is, okay? He is just jumping for joy. He doesn't give a single shit, okay? He will knock over every single piece of his mom's china. And then when she yells at him, he'll cry. But again, look at that Look at that little rat. If you look closely, he's got eyebrows. He's got two little eyebrows. If I spray painted elbow macaroni black and glued him to my forehead, I would look just like you, kid, okay? That's unsettling. I make sure never to wear only primary colors just because I don't want people in public to call me Caillou. I don't think anyone has the balls to, but there's going to be that one day that someone walks up to me and says, Caillou? And I'm going to turn around because I know, I know that's what I look like because I decided to wear yellow, blue, and red outside of the house. I'm victim blaming myself at this point. All right, Caillou, you're going in the A tier because again, he's got the eyebrows. So he doesn't look exactly like me and he's a child. I'm a grown man, not a kid. But if I dressed up like that, you would immediately get it. All right, here's our boy, Charlie Brown, bringing it downtown. I, I don't know if you've seen recently, but I, I literally turned myself into Charlie Brown, and I was surprised at just how much I looked like Charlie Brown. Charlie Brown's got this just 
really nice round soft face you know just like me we're hanging out we're twins okay so unfortunately i do think he belongs in a charlie brown belongs in a okay honestly he looks so close to me it's unsettling you all have all your fun anime cosplay people that you can do okay you can look hot and whatever but i got charlie brown i called dibs on him and none of you can have him uh one of these days i will be sexy charlie brown and that is not a sentence I really needed to say. So I, I do take that back. I do apologize. All right. If you, if you don't know this man, you're lying. Okay. Every, every single person on this internet most likely knows who this is. I'm not even straight and I know who this man is. You're lying to me if you don't know who this is. And honestly, that's okay. Or you're a literal child and I please do not want you to know who this is. Cherish your youth. Honestly, this man is like Barbie with how many jobs he's had at this point. And I don't think I can compete. I can barely do my own job as is. I think this one's a stretch, okay? I think this one's even more of a stretch than Billy Corgan. I don't think I look anything like this man. I think he's got to go in C because he's got he's got a lot of hair going on. So you're going in the C tier. We got everybody's favorite bad boy, Mr. Clean. He's rocking the one earring, okay? He's like weirdly erotic nowadays in his commercials. This is one though. He's a little tan. If you look at me, I'm like a she of paper. My teeth are yellower than this. But if I got a tan, I'm going to throw in a gold hoop and wear a white tee. I mean, check this out, okay? It's going to be scary, the transformation. Your therapist was wrong when they said real life Mr. Clean can't hurt you. I'm coming for you. I'm here to clean. You're so dirty. <laughs> If I'm being honest, and I, I hate to be honest in these situations, okay, I would much rather lie and make myself feel better, but I really do look like Mr. Clean. He's going A tier. If I can dress up like him and you know exactly who it is, sucks to suck, and that's on me. Next up, we got NoHo Hank. If you haven't seen the show Barry, don't worry, because I haven't either. I haven't even seen my own representation on TV. It's mostly because I watch cartoons, mostly animated things. If it's real life, I don't want to see it because real life is hard enough. I don't need to watch other people going through the same things I'm going through or even worse. Okay, this dude looks exactly like me because he's got the same thing I do, okay? He has the same kind of alopecia that I have, so it's, it's honestly really hard not to say that he doesn't look like me. But we do have our differences, okay? Our faces aren't exactly the same. If you really look at them up close, but from far away, we'd, we'd be twins, like creepy ghost-like twins that you'd see in the corner of your room that say, hello, mother. And you don't have kids, but I got a polo, okay? I've got tons of polos, so I probably have a polo that looks like this. So let me, let me throw that on real quick and just give you a show, give you a spin, give you a twirl. Fashion. Fashion. Okay, imagine this, but like a little darker and like completely different because the pattern is not the same, but I tried my best. Okay, this is the best dad polo I have, but here, let me give it my best shot. Look at this power stance. That was pretty close, guys. That was honestly so very close. I think I'd be remiss, honestly, if I did not give this another S tier. Because little stonk guy, he sets the bar. But if he's setting the bar, I feel like Noho Hank is the bar. He's the structure that the bar is attached to. He is me in essence. Next up, we got Pitbull. Absolute menace. I dressed up like him for Halloween. I could throw in a picture there. It's like me and all my, my little skeleton family. And then look at little Frankie. Oh, he was a little shark. Look at that little boy. Kind of gross, but he does what he can. See? this is another one where it's like i can dress up just like pitbull i gotta throw on like a little goatee but check this out okay it's gonna be crazy it's just like it's basically the hitman costume but with aviators hey guys i'm at the hotel the motel and the holiday inn uh the next few few days so if you do want to catch one of my shows it would be greatly appreciated i would love that uh to all my fans out there dale this is mr 305 signing out and i will see you soon <laughs> Do I look like Pitbull? Guys, can you validate me? I mean, you guys gotta give it to me. I'm kind of I'm kind of slaying with these costumes. I've got a lot of options for Halloween costumes, but I feel like Pitbull, he's going B, because he doesn't look exactly like me, but I could dress up like him, but he's a little different than these four folks up here. He's he's closer to Johnny Sins than Caillou, you know, and I'm closer to Caillou. All right, next up, we got our boy Popeye. Uh, I don't really see this one as much as some people have said. I haven't also seen this comment a lot. You know, I had to dig pretty deep to find this one. So, I mean, I would honestly put this in DRF. I'm going to be controversial, and I'm going to say I look nothing like Popeye. You know, when I eat spinach, I just throw up. And like I don't I don't think I would ever own a sailor hat. I don't think I'd ever own a, like a cob pipe kind of situation. But his forearms are jacked. And that's also the only way he got those forearms. 
If you get that joke, you get that joke. I'm not gonna explain it. Honest, let's just let's just do D. I don't think he he is bald, so he looks somewhat like me. You know, so he can't be he can't be F. If you're an F tier, you got a whole head of hair. Popeye, you can stay there. If we're talking about the fast food restaurant Popeyes, now that's S tier. Okay, that's a that's a whole different ballpark. All right, we're moving on to one that I get constantly commented. It's Saitama. You would most likely know him as One Punch Man. I haven't seen the anime yet. I've seen a couple episodes with my old roommates. Little too sexual for me. Why is that insect lady so hot? I really do look like Saitama. It, it makes me feel good to know that um, I'm represented in the superhero category. When I grow up, I want to be a hero just like you. I think it's an S tier. I honestly do. I really, he looks so similar to me. It's an A in the sense that if I dress up like him, I look like him, but he's so smooth and shiny that it's just uncanny. All right, the final one we have is Voldemort. I mean, you can't tell me I'm putting this face next to mine. If I put a little eyeshadow in there, I would look just like Voldemort. One thing he's got on top of me, though, is he's got like no nose and I've got all nose. Like if you look at this, this will peck the shit out of you. OK, so watch your eyeballs coming for you. This is just a scarily accurate vision of what my future is going to be. So at least I have that. I'm going to put Voldemort in the A tier. I honestly don't think I really need to dress up that hard to look just like him. And hey, he's got no eyebrows. So we're rocking that same thing. Me and my boy, we get each other. He's evil and wants to take over the world. So I don't get, I don't get him there, but we see eyebrow to eyebrow. Well, let me know what you thought about this tier list. Do you think this is kind of accurate? Should I have moved some of those people up a little bit? Maybe. I don't know. I probably missed a ton of people that I look like. So get creative in the comments and bully me again. You know, tell me who I look like. Just roast the shit out of me. I can, I can handle it. I can handle it. I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you did like it, make sure to give this video a like because I like when you give it a like. And subscribe to this YouTube channel because we make great content like this all the time, okay? And if you don't see me here on YouTube, I'm doing all that stupid stuff. And especially on Twitch, we're doing some completely different stuff over there on Twitch. Watch me live streaming Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, sometimes Saturday if I'm not doing anything. But it usually starts around 7 p.m. If you follow me on Instagram, I always post it on my story. So it's my YouTube name, Steerling, with an underscore at the end. Not hard to find. Go to my profile. Click the link. The links are everywhere, guys. The links are everywhere. All right. Well, I hope you have an amazing, awesome, wonderful, fantastic, super spectacular rest of your day. Because you know what? You deserve it. All right. Well, I will see you in the next video. Or you can just, like I said, watch me again and, and again and again and again and again and again and again until you get tired. Hopefully you don't. Okay, bye. Oh,